it's just a weird world, you know. So, do you think it always was? Yeah, it always yeah. was, and the and the world has always been ending too. It isn't that this generation is the end of the world. The world has always been at the end, and everybody, every generation is always feeling, oh, they're, they're, the young people have gone too far, and they're. You know, they're out of control and all of this type of thing. And, you know, these were the same people who, when they were younger, they liked Elvis. And, oh, Elvis, they have to crop him because he's shaking his hips. And Elvis was, uh, he was black metal to to the 1950s. Or he was uh, two live crew or he was whoever is controversial, whatever period that you're going to talk about. He was the controversial one. So uh, these people forget that. And now they get older and I guess they just get uh, they feel that they're losing control. And so they want to become the, the sour old man next door and shake their fists at the clouds and that kind of thing. Yeah, I get I get protecting people like I'm definitely all for people who should be able to live how they want to live, love who they want to love. But I also I also can't stand the censorship. So I, I'm like you. I stand in the middle. I am definitely not a left or a right. And I have no interest in getting involved with any of that shit. And I, I back what you're doing with the, the, you know, the rainbow merch. I love that. When I first saw that come out, I was like, fuck, yeah, that's awesome. It makes such a great statement. And it does sort of like it shouldn't. But it still kind of shocks me that people give a fuck like you get shit for that. Like, what the yeah. why, why does that like what is the threat to you? that someone chooses to live this way. I don't fucking understand it. But in the same breath, I hate the censorship too. It's like, it's a dichotomy, man. It's tough. 